welcome to Let's Play Super Marissaland. I kind of wanted to get back to my back to my Dojin roots, my Toho roots. I haven't played a Toho game in a little while. I haven't played a Dojo game, Dojin, Dojo. Yeah. I haven't played a Dojin game in a little while. And Super Marissa Land, it's dumb and rompy, and I have other reasons for doing this game as well. But regardless, it's, um, funky little thing. Super Marissa Land plays a lot like, say, the original Super Mario Brothers on the NES, so that'll be a good time. Let me jump in. The controls are a little finicky, but we'll get to that when we get to that. There are three options here on the main menu. You can either go to Extra, Start, or Stage. Start plays through the normal game, which is 20 stages long. Extra goes through the Extra game, which is 20 stages long. And Stage lets you practice a single stage if you so choose. The game also has native gamepad support, so that's pretty awesome. I, um, I'm going to go through the regular story of the game. Story, if you could call it that. I'm going to play through the regular mode of the game, and I'm going to attempt extra mode, but no guarantees. So without further ado... It's one of these buttons. Stage 1. Marissa, times 5. 400 seconds. We're at our house. Typical Mario fashion, when you move forward, you can no longer go backwards. There's a jump button and a run button. And that's about all you need. Get mushrooms to power up. My... I am now three heads tall! Go me! The power-ups work in an... interesting way in this game. You get the little points. These points are awesome. I don't know if you get enough points, you get enough life. You get an extra life. Something about that. I don't know. Oh man, I'm four heads tall! One of the benefits to being the different heads tall is being three heads tall gets you an extra hit, because when you get hit, you get sent back to two heads tall. Being four heads tall grants you not only the previous hit, you cannot go past four heads tall normally. I want whatever's in this. Points. That was well worth my time. When you're four heads tall, though, you when you get hit, you still go back to two heads tall, but you can also break these blocks with your head, so that is the advantage of being four heads tall. You also notice I'm not holding down the run button all the time, despite what Mario games have taught us, if only because the momentum in this game is tricky. The game does not control that super great. There are other power-ups other than simply mushrooms. Well, not really, no. There's actually just a different kind of mushroom that also does things. But sadly, you don't get anything fancy like fire flowers or anything. Oh, no. It's pretty simplistic in its overall design. Oh, man. It's pretty simplistic in its overall design. It's a short enough game be perfectly honest, it's not the highest budget best game in the world, but it's still got some charm to it. I mean, look at that big old two-head tall Marissa on the side. Jumping on them guys. Now the red guys differ from the white guys in that the red guys will not walk off edges. They will actually stay on the platform. Whereas white guys will wander right off the platform to their doom. Kind of like that. I almost didn't get out of the way of that in time. Yeah, eat it. Heck yeah, four heads tall. Look at how tall I- Oh, that was terrifying. That was still terrifying. Because, as I've mentioned, the controls are the greatest in the world. Yeah, getting them points. I don't know, I've got 105 points. And so far, I'm yet to gain any. How many points do you need? Maybe it's just a high score thing? Like, hey man, I got more points than you. Look at how much points I got! I got all 113 of them points! Ah, oh, crap. 
You can jump pretty high if you jump off of a dude. In fact, you can jump higher than you otherwise could. Like, not just the height given to you by the enemy, you actually gain, like, an additional block on top of that. I think you also gain height if you're running. So if you're, like, running, you can jump higher. It takes a second to build up speed, though. So you're not just going full speed right off the bat. I think one of the biggest problems with the controls is... I think one of the biggest problems with the controls is once you jump, you're almost committed to that jump arc. Give me that. Ah, crap. I want to be up there. I want to get the things. What are up high? The blue guys bounce. It's not completely obvious. That's what they do. Ah, if I was big, I could probably still not get up there. Actually, no, I probably could. Well, I could probably get up there if I could go backwards just by jumping on those guys. I'm gonna go up top. I'm gonna go up top, get them prizes. Um, I don't... They don't often let you jump, like, over the level or anything, so you can't just, like, outright break the game. Oftentimes. Oh my goodness, I thought I wasn't gonna get that. Hey, guy. You can run over small gaps, so that's spiffy. Oh man, I am four heads tall, which means I can go down there and I can get the things. I'm getting the things! Get all them things I got! Oh, that was almost... that almost killed me. Give me that! Heck yeah! Almost got 200! 200! And I still gained nothing. Still nothing! It's probably just a high score thing. I don't know. Try next stage! Stage four. Back to being two heads tall. Aren't I tiny? I had a fun time getting the controller to work with this game, if only because the game does have native joy gamepad support, and I didn't think it did. Give me that thing! I'm six heads tall! Look at that! Now when you're six heads tall, you can shoot! Eat it! Pew, 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 pew. Mm -hmm. Now, there's a another special prize if you happen to be four heads tall. When you get that thing. But I suppose we'll get to that when we get to it. I can also not shoot down, so all the enemies, like, ground level, I can't touch. I can shoot him. Ha! Oh! Man prizes! Oh crap. Momentum! I've mentioned the momentum in this game. Oh my goodness, I want whatever is in that, but I don't think I can get it without... Yes! I knew it was a... No! Beer's game. Thought you and me had a D. Ah, poo! Ha! If you're two heads tall when you get the big one, you get set to four heads tall. If you are three heads tall when you get that, you get set to crap. Six heads tall, and you get another prize if you're four heads tall. Give me that. You come back over here. Especially as the stages get harder, I'm going to be playing more and more defensively. If only because the controls do not let you do much in the way of, like, on-the-fly changes. 
Like, hey, if I have to build up speed and jump across this pit, I'm probably just gonna get hit by whatever it is that's across that pit. Like, if they want to put a guy there, I'm just gonna hit him, because I can't control my momentum enough in the air to do it. If you're not... yeah, even if you're not running, you can't do much, but... At least if you're not running, at least you can... If you're not running, you're at least not gonna fly, like, way off screen. Oh man, I finally got, next, got that extra life! What was that, 500 points? Banzai! Yeah! Getting them prizes. Back to the two-head stall. We're running. We're going. We're on stage five. Logs fall when you step on them, but you can just jump off them and they go back up high again. So that's pretty alright. Gonna play this sort of cautiously. Because I don't want my momentum to fudge with me. And it will. Okay, you white guys are just gonna wander on down. And not be a problem anymore. Yeah, I was gonna say, really? There's nobody over there? BS, there's nobody over there. I'm gonna catch me. I'm gonna catch me off guard. Okay, I know for a fact that there is a thing in this. And I'm gonna get hit immediately! I didn't get hit immediately. Oh, I could have gotten up there! If I jumped off the guy! Well, it's gone now. Gone forever. We'll never know what was in that star block. Ooh! Whew! Whew! Banzai! Oh my dear, I did not build up any speed after that, and I was terrified. Okay, now here... yeah, fish. Fishy fish. So I'm gonna wait for these red guys to get a little bit closer before I jump, because... I'm going to go careening over top of that edge and hit them otherwise. No! Oh boy. I keep thinking like this looks like the end. I should be able to blitz head. Yay! Try next stage. Stage six, here we go. You're blue. You are made of blue. That is your color, that is your designated purpose. Really, nothing up here? Let me jump all the way up there and then not give me a prize for it? What's wrong with you? Okay, there's going to be a nice prize in here, I'm sure. Yeah, four heads tall. Hmm. Guarantee you there is prize, and I want it. Really? Just gonna give me points for that. Ugh! Heck yeah, you get to see it! Eight heads tall, go! Keep it going! No, I can get more! Ah, oh, yeah! 
This is beautiful. Still going! Yeah! Giant, eight head tall Marissa Go! <laughs> Eat it, sign! You don't tell me what to do. Alright, until next time, everyone, we'll pick up from here on stage seven. I don't know, I'm enjoying it so far, but then again, that uh, eight heads tall Marissa is kind of a thing. Until then, everyone.